Hey guys, Zizarin here. So, there's a new league coming up and a lot of people aren't really familiar with Energy Shield. It can be slightly daunting for new players not to rely on life potions. And uh, a lot of people ask me, Zizarin, how can I go CI early in a league? And uh, a lot of people think that it's expensive to craft the gear you need when this isn't the case. So, here I have some different items. Most of them are low item level and I have a high item level shield as an example as well. So ideally the item level you want on for example a Valregalia early on would be item level 69. Pretty easy to get. Item level 75 then you can get the Resplendent instead of Incandescent. But uh, either way you can get a very very high ES value on that low item level. You do not need an item level 84. And then all you do is you ult until you get a really high energy shield value. Regal it, doesn't matter. If you actually hit something, that's amazing. You've already got a 650, 700 shield. And then uh, if it doesn't hit, you can just craft percentage energy shield. And you're looking at an over 500 shield chest, which rivals Combs Heart, except you can 5 or 6 link it later. The same with Helmet. Basically, just try to get Blazing, something like that. It's got pretty low item level. And uh, then you ult Regal. Hopefully you hit, if you don't, craft flat, you've already got a 300 ES helmet. So with a really, really low budget, you could most likely use less than 500 alterations, and you only need one regal per piece. You're not looking at actually hitting here, you're only looking at using Haku. You can get a over 500 ES chest, over 300 ES helmet, a really good shield as well. It can be slightly difficult to get decent boots, especially if you want stuff like movement speed. You're looking at an easy 10,000 ES value here with uh, minimal investment in the tree, minimal investment on gear, energy shield is not expensive. So this is something that everybody can do. This is not reserved for the top 1%. It can be pretty scary to play energy shield for the first time with no instant potions, but with things like Vile Discipline and uh, instant leech builds, or a logout macros, portaling to town, you have quite a lot of options for surviving. And it's such high values of uh, raw health then a life potion isn't a massive deal anyway. You also have large advantages in uh, the laboratory because CI takes so much less damage from the traps. And if we put these items on a character, you can see that even with mediocre gear and not even wearing any jewelry and with just discipline, you can get nearly 10k ES. This character does not have a ridiculous amount of energy shield on the tree either. It's only got a natural calm. Just the normal, pretty normal energy shield nodes. And just with that, like, mediocre investment, you're hitting nearly 10,000 energy shield. With a chest rival in Combs Heart. Except, it has sockets. Hopefully this helps shed some light on energy shield CI builds for some of you. If you have any questions, you can drop by my stream at Twitch TV slash Scissorin. Feel free to subscribe to my YouTube, Twitter, and uh, good luck in Breach, guys. Hope you guys have an amazing time. <laughs>